um, you know, where does AI and robots c c fit in this sort of sustainable energy picture? Like, uh, is that just like some weird side project or, or what, you know? Um, but it's, it's because what we're really aiming for here is uh, maybe a better way to think of it rather than sustainable energy is sustainable abundance for all. So if you think about like what is the future that would, what's, what's the most exciting future that you could possibly imagine? Like what does that future look like? It's worth thinking about that. Just, just think, just, in, just, just imagine a future. What does that, that amazing future look like? How about a future where you can have any good or service you want at will? Um, a future of abundance for all, where really anyone can have anything. It, it sounds impossible. It sounds like surely such a thing cannot be the case. But I'm, what I'm here to tell you is that that will indeed be the case, that the future we're headed for is one where you can literally just have anything you want. Like, if there's a good or service you want, you'll be able to have it. And, uh, and ultimately, everyone in the world will be able to have anything they want. Um, wh what's key to that is robotics and AI. So once you have self-driving cars and you have autonomous humanoid robots, where everyone can have their own personal C-3PO and R2-D2, but even better than that, that's Optimus. You can imagine like your own personal robot buddy uh, that is uh, a great friend, but also takes care of uh, your house, will we'll clean your house, will mow the lawn, uh, will walk the dog, um, will teach your kids, uh, will we'll babysit, um, and, and, and will also, also enable the production of goods and services uh, basically with no limit. Um, and when you combine that with sustainable energy from the sun and batteries, uh, we can also, at the same time, also maintain a great uh, environment. So that, I think, is the future that we, that we want, a future where uh, nobody's, nobody's in need. You can have what you want. Um, and we still, but we still have nature. We still have, uh, you know, the the beautiful parts of nature that, that we like. Um, I think that's probably the best future. I can't, I'd like, what other future would you want? I think that's like the cool future. And also space travel, let's not forget that. <laughs> um, so if you can have basically anything you want and travel to space and go to Mars, and that would be, it's about as good as it gets, you know? It's like, that's it. So, that's really what we're, what we're trying to do, is take the set of actions most likely to lead to a great future for all. So that's what I mean by sustainable abundance. Um, and uh, the, the, the combination of things that we're making um, with Optimus and AI, com and AI Compute will achieve uh, an age of abundance for all. Like, actually. So going to be pretty great. Um, and Model Y became uh, the best